Hi guys, in today's video I will show you how to make and print a model from the Minecraft game. At first we need to create a new or edit an existing model. If you have already experienced Minecraft, you know that objects are created by placing individual blocks. You can choose colors or materials of blocks in the Minecraft inventory. However, the choice doesn't matter in our case of 3D printing, but if you want to print in colors, I recommend using different in-game colors for better clarity. Your objects shouldn't have air bubbles. For example, when you are going to print a house, its inside should be filled with full blocks. Or if you want to print your creation with a pad, make sure that there is no empty space in it. In Minecraft you can find caves under the surface, you should fill them too. You don't have to fill blanks block by block, you can use MC Edit to do that at once. The best way to uncover problems and empty spaces is exporting your object using MC Edit to so-called super flat world, that you can easily create in the game. I decided to print a cabin in the middle of the forest. I let the trees grow separately in the game and then exported them using Mineways to STL file. Make sure that the sizes and the scales of your objects matches or are similar if you are going to make your model from multiple parts. Then I printed the trees with a support material and color change. If you want to know how to 3D print in colors, you can watch about it in our older video. After that I printed the pad that was tall enough to properly show the color changes. Then I printed the cabin which I have scaled to a bigger size to make it more visible. I didn't want the model to look empty, so I also printed some Minecraft characters. You can find plenty of them on Thingiverse. At last, I painted the details on the pad and glued all the parts together. You can create pretty much everything in Minecraft, although every model will be kind of boxy. The game suits simple creations. And what have you printed from Minecraft? Show us in the comments and don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you wouldn't miss upcoming videos.